given 5.9. Difficulty. And next up now from Romania, Anna Horvath. So I enjoyed watching this gymnast yesterday. Incredible body type. And also using that stoop in and out. They've really got to nail these handstands and that pirouette was great but was late, wasn't it? The last half turn only just happened in time. Better on the full turn and again. Gosh, she's packing. You see, she is linking moves really ambitiously. It makes it quite a short routine as well when you do that. Another wonderful double straight dismount. She's got the moves, she's got the grace, and she has got the style. And she got a medal. Well, I'll tell you what, the real point about handstands, Christy, do they really expect one and a half turns to land in handstand? That's a huge ask, isn't it? Well, yes. Uh, yes, they do want one and a half turns to land in handstand, and there's deductions for how many degrees off handstand you are. They're fairly tolerant if it's only a short uh, way off handstand, but the, are we going to see this? Look, look, look. That last half turn only just happened before her feet got to the low bar, so that'll be 0.3 or even a little bit more. And just a tiny fraction apart. Now, this one, again, is a little bit late, you see, by the time she finished. But she did very, very well because she linked it straight into the next move. So uh, she's it's a short routine. So the more moves you have in, the more chances of giving marks away to the judges. And she waited on this release as well before she got into the dismount. She did, didn't she? Lovely. She'll tidy all those little things up. When we next see her, those things will be spot on. Well, 14.65 is the score to beat at the moment if she wants to get up into the top three. It's Coco Tsurumi. <laughs> so Paul Grass, just one gymnast to go after her. Paul Grass, yeah, she has gone up into the top three, 14.675, with one gymnast to go. Coco chuckles, she's in silver medal place.